So my name is Joe Farrenden. I've uh, been in Tallahassee now for about seven years and been a member at Celebration for about what, a year and a half, almost two years. I didn't grow up in the church. Uh, I came to Christ through my wife, uh, Sarah. We were looking around at churches in Tallahassee and we went to Celebration and it just felt a perfect fit. I've always felt like I was the lost lamb coming back to the flock and the first sermon that was being uh, preached at Celebration was about the lost lamb, so it just felt a great fit for us. In December, I was baptized. That was a big moment for me. My family were able to come over from uh, London and be there and share in that moment with me. Shortly after, I joined a tea group with uh, Doug and Eric. We completed that and now I am leading a tea group with uh, a couple guys. It's, it's great to see how I've grown, spiritually grown in Christ basically through participating in the tea group and now leading the tea group. Yeah, my uh, wife started a tea group not long after I did. One of the best compliments I've had um, was from her actually. Uh, she commented that she felt like she was the spiritual leader in the family and then when I started a tea group she saw that change in me and felt like I had become the spiritual leader. It has strengthened my marriage uh, with the chapters broken out and just the, the different focusing on a different topic each week. There's been many a times where I've learned something in a tea group that I've just been, I couldn't wait to share with her, something that I know she has discussed or thought about and I've just felt like I've had the answer explained to me in the tea group that I can just relate to her and marriage is kind of like a tea group, it's a very intimate tea group, just two people just sharing what we've learned and discussing and growing together. It's helped me in parenting. It's helped me be more patient and more kind and loving. It's something I want to give to my son as well. Show him that you don't have to have all the answers, but if you spend that time and meet with people, you will learn and then you will get to the point where you feel comfortable teaching and going out. You have to disciple, you have to uh, look after your kids, you've got to bring your kids up the right way, you've got to show them the path and can't do everything for them but you can give them that guidance that they need. It's the same with uh, discipleship, you can do the same thing, you can give them the tools, you can teach them uh, to the point when they're ready to go out and uh, continue that tradition. I love being a part of that chain reaction, being a member of a tea group and uh, now leading a tea group, um, the two that I'm in my group I'm just hoping and praying that they then after at the end of this will go out and do the exact same thing that I've done and then allow me to pursue further uh, more tea groups or further education.